when it comes to writing about their life purpose, students don't see the purpose. I feel like it's a little bit pointless at the time. Since 2002, Pepperdine has required incoming freshmen to write a response essay to an article about vocation. The majority of students believe the assignment is not beneficial. First two days in school and you're already writing an essay about what you want to do. I think it could help because it could center you more on what you want to do, but I feel like people don't really take it seriously. However, some students recognize the benefit it could have. It's good to have something that even if it forces you to like think about what you want to do, it'll just be good for your life and for um, you as a person. Administrators say the purpose of the essay is to make a general impression on incoming students. It created a conversation uh, among faculty and students for, for the entire campus. The essay pushes students to see vocation as a developing concept. Students um, see their faculty members, and it looks like we just sort of got on an escalator and rode it to our calling. And the fact is, it, it's been a journey for all of us. However, both students and administrators agree there is a disconnect between the assignment and its purpose. Since we write it freshman year and we're never asked to return to it, it loses its impact. Thompson suggests the disconnect is due to changes over time. It was just what happens typically with a program that starts out like gangbusters and then after a few years it, it, uh, the leadership has changed and there's not nearly the enthusiasm or coordination that there could be. Though it has been 17 years since it was implemented, the essay is still a requirement for incoming freshmen. The creator of the essay says students should push themselves to find the value in it. Set aside some time to enter that conversation. Um, I would say enter it as if your life depended on it, because in some ways it does. Vernie Covarubias, Newswaves 32.